Meteorologist Paul Horton joins us from home, and I know you're always kind of like adjusting the temperature for each of those different locations, Paul. It's always <laughs> bundle up, I think, is the best way to do it. But bundle a lot of up people tonight. can stay indoors and watch. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And, and right now I'm live inside the stadium where an oh. amazing Fiesta Bowl will take place, Nicole, against Iowa State and Oregon. We're going to talk more about that in just a moment. But uh, let's get on with that forecast and show you what we're, we're expecting. Yeah, for the uh, first part of 2021. And as you can see uh, with the satellite and radar, you know, this is kind of interesting. We're seeing a few little light spotty showers and some flurries out there. I uh, just got off the phone with the National Weather Service. And yeah, we're seeing a few sprinkles. See on the outskirts of a globe and definitely some cloud cover. And the clouds are going to stick around through the evening hours. High today, well, with this system that's rolling through, temperatures cooler than average. We should be around 66 degrees this time of year, but uh, we only had a high of 60 so far. And that's where we sit currently. We're sitting at 60 in Phoenix, upper 50s in Maryville, uh, lower 60s in Gilbert. I want to show you that satellite and radar. Look at the snowfall across areas of Texas. Yeah, that's impressive. For us, yeah, just dealing with a few clouds. And we got this area low that's just going to continue to linger through tomorrow. And then, uh, well, by Saturday into Sunday, we'll start to see those temperatures gradually warm up. Uh, we'll see highs right where they should be. So tonight, if you're heading out and about for uh, New Year's Eve, uh, heading outside to bank some pots and pans, we'll see temps in the upper 40s. Uh, a few clouds continue to stick around. Lows tonight dropping down to the lower 40s. And that seven-day planner, here you go. Friday, 65 for the first day of 2021, 64 on Saturday. And then we warm up nicely. We'll see uh, mid to upper 60s uh, both Sunday into Monday and stay at least close to our average or near average Tuesday, Wednesday into Thursday.